So I picked up this Yerf Dog Spider Box on Marketplace and decided I was going to refinish it. Um, here I am painting it. I disassembled most of it, painted it, um, clear coated it, I just sprayed it, nothing fancy. Um, here's where I finally got, uh, I changed out some axles, I changed out some bearings, joints, just made it sound as I could because I knew what I was doing to it was going to add a lot more power than it was used to so I also got a new axle um, a reinforced axle for it um, I broke the original um, the torque just kind of snapped it so I ended up doing the axle I still need to do the shocks I haven't got there yet um, I mounted the controller here um, I'm using a 72 volt 64 amp hour uh, Amarage battery it was off of one of my motorcycles I built um, I wired up the controller like I said 72 volt giving it about 420 phase amps uh, QS 180 motor I played around with the sprockets a little bit um, added some more teeth um, I had to actually lower the teeth count because like I said it wouldn't the back wheels wanted to spin so I had to um, play with the ratios a little bit but originally I got it where I wanted it and um, it's more than enough power for me and whoever wants to ride with me um, I added a solar panel to the top of it in an inverter and there's a 100 amp hour 12 volt battery that I can use to charge the bike or the, the card, I'm sorry. If I'm in the woods or something, the 100 amp hour, it won't charge the whole thing, but it definitely will, it'll give me a boost. Um, and if I'm sitting somewhere and not riding, it'll do it.